my friends, welcome to today's video. My name is Kalmar. I hope you're all having a nice day or it's going to be a nice weekend as well. Before we get started, I did talk to IGG's life support. I talked to Faith. He said he's going to send IGG a message regarding the social media codes, if they can give it to me or not. Let's hope they can give it to me. But shout out to you, Faith. It was very kind of you to help me out. I don't know if they can actually do it or not, but uh, we'll see. Now, the beginning of the video you guys are mostly interested about is why is chrono keeper broken let's go take a look I'll, sh I'll show you also we did not win uh, lord limpia because we got put up against uh, czsk devils we did really really good if you're wondering what the final score was 63,000 to 67,000. now angry soldiers versus czz the uh, czz is gonna win but the main thing i want to show you is chrono keeper and that's mine's uh, chrono keeper so let's go take a look at their accounts for a second let's do their guild bot i mean guild base uh, stronghold um, Preddy CZ's uh, account. So as you can see, 35 is Enlightenment, uh, 25, 35, Air Elite, 25, and Pantilthia, 31. And uh, as you can see, it's a great setup, great heroes, uh, 10,000 power. And then we move over to Mind's uh, hero, which is just the Chrono Keeper. Let's take a look. Chrono Keeper is level 35 with uh, pretty much some sick glyphs. That's all I can say. But he has 35,000 power, one of the highest tier players in the game. But that doesn't matter. That's just only one hero versus five. So you have to imagine one hero versus five. You would think that five of the heroes would win, right? No, 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 no. Let's, 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 let me show you why. All right, you can see he's going to drop it right from down there. And then he's going to use this uh, skill. Look at the heroes. They're all dead. Those heroes in the middle are dead. The Bastion is opening up. They're dying. And everything is pretty much dead. That is Chrono Keeper's skill. He only did one. You can do three of that. So he pretty much destroyed the heroes without even letting them move. Penthiltia was moving around over there. He, she couldn't do anything. She's dead by the time she gets even close. That's Chrono Keeper. There's a reason why everybody's using Chrono Keeper in the game. There's a reason why it's broken. Chrono Keeper can get up to at least 150 million damage. Like, that is insane, right? Now, let's go take a look at another hero, another base, technically. And that's uh, Cog48. He's a very hard player for me even to challenge. It might beat him in one shot. So, he's got 19,000 power. And, uh, of course, 27, 25, 27, 26, 35. Still decent amount of heroes. Decent amount of equipment. And he has decent glyphs on as well. So let's go take a look and let's see what happens. There you go. Puts uh, Crone on the side. Drops a Divine right there. And there you go. It's pretty much they're all dying. Look at that. They're, they're all dead. Oh, that, That's pretty much it for Crono right there. Seeing that? He killed everybody. In, in like a couple of seconds. That's why, that's why most people are saying this is broken. Even I'm saying this is broken, hero. There's a reason why everybody's using it right now, all the top players. There's a reason why I keep saying Chrono is one of the best heroes currently out there. Because that's how strong he is. Let's go take a look at one more and then we'll go take a look at the top players' uh, attacks. They can't beat mine. There's no way they can. They'll, they'll win it because uh, Angry Soldiers' uh, players are a lot stronger. I mean, well, weaker. So, again, here it is. He's putting the Divine down right there and he's using the... Uh, Arachne's divine to tether them and they're all dying without using any other of his hero skills just only uh, a Chrono Keeper right there and then using uh, Arachne's skill but just Chrono Keeper alone could just do that much damage as well without even uh, Arachne even helping that is Chrono Keeper that's why I'm saying one of the most broken heroes is him unless the next update where they release a glyph to counter uh chrono keepers divine like before where uh they uh in in introduced uh, the party set to counter well, i think they introduced the party set i believe the party set was still in i wasn't around when title was released or when the uh, party set released but that is mostly what uh, they're probably gonna do let's go take a look at summit and then let's uh, see what the top players are doing with chrono keeper so let's go over here. Red Devil is uh, the Stronghold in Dragons. And uh, Super Evolution did 100,000 on them. Wow, congratulations, Super. Jez, let's go take a look since Jez finished him off. 
He's gonna put it off. So it's in the side where mostly all of them are dropping uh, Chrono Keeper. He's gonna grab all their attention. As you can see, use one of the divines over there for Arachne. And then he's probably gonna use the other divines on the, the center over here. As you can see right there, there's a center. And one more in, in where the center of those heroes are, like right over here. Yeah. So that's pretty much uh, the strategy they're using. And once the heroes from the Bastions come out also, uh, they're gonna get knocked out because of the divine is super, super strong. And uh, yeah, as you can see, all the heroes are going out. Before it was like a little battle. It would take a long time for the heroes to go out but because he goes back and forth, back and forth between the players attacking each other with the heroes. But now with Chrono Keeper, it's just uh, Chrono Keeper versus Chrono Keeper. Because Chrono Keeper does so much damage, it, it is literally insane. So that's why Chrono Keeper is the most broken hero in the game. That's why a lot of people are using everything they have to get Chrono Keeper to a high level. Now, if you're watching this and uh, you're like, oh, I'm Odenang, I should get Chrono Keeper as well to the max level. No, you could not. Do not do it. If you're a free-to-play player, you do not want to take on Chrono Keeper. If you are a paid player and you have the money to spend, go after Chrono Keeper. I highly recommend it. But if you do not have any money to spend, do not... Take Chrono Keeper. You can work on him slowly in the background, but don't put all your resources into him. You're not gonna get him to a decent level because it requires like at least 35 just for it to be like OP, plus all the masters as well. So just remember that. That is Chrono Keeper for you, my friends. Uh, next uh, video is probably gonna be me. Uh, I don't mind. I got some returning uh, chest. I'm grabbing these. Ooh, ancient power shard. No, I need any more ancient. Is trash but yeah next one we're gonna be grabbing all of these and then grabbing some pen and leveling up pen as well but i hope you did enjoy my friends if you're new to the channel subscribe and hopefully we can get this you could code as you the social media codes hopefully i just can give it to me if not uh, we're gonna keep messaging them but yeah if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button like the video and let me know your thoughts and opinion on chrono keeper peace out friends and take care